will do it. You're English, aren't you? Eh? Wouldn't you like some tea? I've still got a few stops to make. Well, if it's no trouble, I'd rather have coffee. I thought all you English drank tea. Oh. Lupe. Café, pour favor. It's a great thing to know foreign languages. I tell you what, you can help me uh, set them up while we're waiting. My partner called in sick this morning. Flu. Oh, there's a lot of it around. Want a vitamin C? I guess not. No. No, it, it, it's not casual. Sweet tooth, too, please. There you are. How do you like America? It's fine. Just fine. The weather must be very different. It takes I'll get used to. You have a lot of interesting things in England, don't you? I guess you might say that. I better go. Thanks for the coffee. It's good coffee. Oh. Wouldn't you like a petty for it? A what? A... Uh, oh. Hope your friend gets better. Who? Oh, the one with... the one with the flu. Oh, thanks. Remember, lots of vitamin C. Oh, almost forgot. <laughs> hey, you got any idea in dollars and cents how much a divorce could cost you? Melon, please. Grapefruit juice. Who could divorce a girl? You can't even get mad at her. Well, so. Uh, miss, give me this uh, salmon, please. Listen, you got a good thing going for you. I don't know why you'd want to change it. I mean, a married man could cut out of a situation any time he wants and blame it on his wife. Mixed greens, no dressing. Tomato. <laughs> but this girl needs me. She had bags under her eyes from lack of sleep. Um, Are her business decisions cracking up? Huh? Would you like something? Who from needs the bar? who? Give me a scotch and water and a twist. Okay. Bourbon. Rocks. before you do anything final. You know, before I met Jean, <laughs> I thought I was over the hill. It sure was a long setup. That was a very rewarding experience. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Tell her I said to you. Right. No kisses. I'm getting my clothes back. Come on, you kissed everything else. Come on, girls are changing. I'll be out in a minute, okay?
way. I'm out here all by my lonesome. Look, I told you I'd be out in a minute, okay? Okay? Okay. The shadow. No. <laughs> I'm getting in there with you. The hell you are! It seemed like a good idea at the time. Look, we've got the whole weekend ahead of us, okay? You'll see. When Monday comes, you won't even recognize yourself. They unwrap your potential. You'll function better organically. You mean they use pot? <laughs> you know, that's exactly the kind of talk you expect from the middle class. They don't have to use pot. What they use is subverbal experiential techniques that expand your sensory awareness and deepen your psychophysical resources. Right? Where do you get all that crap? <laughs> You know, all that crap just happens to have made it possible for me to love you with all my being. Stupid sometimes. Okay, okay, okay. Mind if I get some gas? You don't understand anything, you know that? I do much better that way. I'm going to the bathroom. Wait till I stop. I'm Ron Abernathy. In Vietnam today, American casualties are reported to be the heaviest in the war. U.S. infantry men tangled with Viet Cong in North Vietnamese regulars near the ancient imperial city of Wei. Our Saigon News Bureau reports over 200 Americans have died in battle so far this week. Well over a thousand have been wounded. In Chicago, an elevated train known as an L has derailed the city of Wabash Street in the downtown loop. The train reportedly made up of five cars was filled with early morning. Say they are investigating the possibility that the dead were said to have been shot at least 12 times, identified as 38-year-old John Atkins, his 25-year-old wife Eileen, and 9-year-old daughter Joan. Police continue the search for the killer. Traffic on the San Bernardino Freeway westbound between Soto and the interchange is heavily congested. Win. I give up. Come on out. Why should I be mad? Because you scared the hell out of me? There's going to be a million laughs this weekend, I can tell. I think you broke my watch. Hey, you know, I don't really feel like doing all that driving today. Why don't we stay here? It's going to be great weather for sailing. We could have dinner at Maddie's. But you promised. You even had me make reservations. So cancel. I can't. Oh, I can. What's the number? No. We never end up doing what I want. Please. I'll do anything you want next week. Well, if it's that important to you. <laughs> <laughs> Can't we later? Now. 
then can we go?